I think to really evaluate the game, I think I need to see it again in its entirety and look at it properly. But it's been a game in which we had a lot of chances, both sides had a lot of chances. It's incredible really that we only scored once when you look at how many times we had the ball in our opponent's penalty area and there was 15 minutes in the second half when they were better than us and that has cost us and they were able to turn that superiority into goals we tried everything in the second half but Sevilla hung on so we just have to congratulate them for their victory I think these kind of games which are really end to end and I think we cause severe problems on the counter attack after their corners but we prefer games where we have a bit more control but if the ball arrives to our strikers up front we have that intention to create danger but our normal game is to control the midfield it's true that so you put us under pressure in the first half but if you look at the profile of the, the players that we have they're players who are top quality you just have to look at their figures their statistics Our coaches in football always look as, look to have as many chances as possible because the technical quality of the players means that they can finish it finish it off that's the great difference between the top strikers and other strikers I'm not talking about statistics I'm talking about the the play in general with the teams but it's gonna change I don't think anybody the passer can be happy after losing a game it doesn't matter that we created a lot of chances the objective is to improve